Hello and welcome to the People's News Stimulus Check and Stimulus Package Update as of January 5th, 2021. Well, today in the news we have uh, Democrats are not going to take the White House from me, Trump says in his George, when he's in Georgia. He basically said, as President Trump is, is campaigning in Georgia on Monday, uh, Monday night for Republicans facing Senate runoff elections, he also focused on his own election. That's right. He's still worried about whether he lost or he won when everyone knows that he actually lost. Isn't that just crappy? And he said, he said, Trump also said, I hope Mike Pence comes through for us. Trump said, of course, if he doesn't come through, I won't like him as much. And as we already know, Pence does not support Trump's uh, electoral fraud investigation because he thinks it's a waste of time. Then D.C. Church sues Proud Boys for destroying BLM sign. Isn't that nice? The Proud Boys destroyed their Black Lives Matter sign and they're getting sued for it. And then the leader of the Proud Boys was arrested for burning a Black Lives Matter banner that was torn down from a historic black church in Washington, Washington D.C. And then Trump declares he would fight like hell to hold on to the presidency and appeal to Republican lawmakers to reverse elections lost when they convey, convey this week to con, confirm the Electoral College votes. Now you know Trump is still whining about the, the election. I mean, we never had a president whine so much. I mean, it's, it's sad and pathetic, you gotta say that, you know. Trump warned Senator Tom Cotton on Monday that Republican Republican votes would never for, voters, so I would never forget the GOP lawmakers who failed to embrace Trump's effort to contest Presidential elect Joe Biden's Electoral College victory. And that is actually all I currently have for current events for you guys. Well, the stimulus package, I say. But today, too, I'm actually more focused on the, the Georgia runoff elections because those, those elections could determine whether or whether or not we get a $2,000 third stimulus check. And. I even have a comment from President like Joe Biden for the uh, Georgia voters. I'll actually put the clip in here for you guys, but it basically it says that uh, he is saying that they should vote for the Democrats to ensure a two thousand dollar stimulus check go out. Otherwise, if they vote for the Republicans, that that might not happen. Although the the um, Republicans have already confirmed that even if they win the election and they still control take control of the Senate that a two thousand dollar stimulus check will go out, but the problem is when will it go out? Because we know Mitch McConnell and him like to throw poison pills at the Democrats. So we don't know if that's gonna when that happen. We couldn't we could actually learn the uh the um results of the election polls as early as tonight, but most likely chances are it won't happen for at least a couple of days because they actually had three thousand early voters, but they can't count them until basically the polls close tonight. And as long as you get in line before seven p.m. Georgia time to do to get your vote in, you still can vote even if it goes past midnight. I mean, this is this basically anything can really happen at this point today. The electoral votes for president the president gets counted tomorrow, and there are. 13 Republican senators, such as Ted Cruz, Josh Hawley, as well as Kelly Leffler, which is currently running for her seat in the uh, Senate in Georgia right now, um, as well as hundreds of House Republicans that will really challenge electoral election results. In a certain battleground, in a certain battleground state, they lost in this. So the group wants to suspend basically the um, electoral college votes in Congress tomorrow so they can run an investigation on the battleground states that Trump lost it, lost it. But most Republicans in Congress see this suspension as a fool's errand for these people that are trying to help out Trump or sort of help out Trump is what we call it. But still, and on a different note, we still have millions, millions of Americans out there that have not received their second stimulus check yet. But the IRS says that they have a deadline of January 15th to issue all the stimulus checks out. So basically the 15th of the, the deadline of them to get the last stimulus checks out. So hopefully it will be getting their stimulus checks within this month. 
I, for instance, have not gotten mine yet, but that's all right. I mean, I'm, I'm more than happy to wait. I have no problem with waiting at this present time because what have we been doing all this time in the first place? But waiting for that. But on other notes, um, hopefully we actually get Democrats in the Senate because uh, Biden's already guaranteed as well as Pelosi that we will get a $2,000 Senate check. I'm not sure if it's going to be like the one that they're, they're thinking about where we get 600 bucks and 1400 bucks later or whether it's going to be 600 bucks now and 2000 bucks later. In either case, more, it's more money to help out the people that actually need it, which is very important. And as far as my stimulus update for the people, this actually covers it all for me. So you guys have a wonderful evening. Please stay safe out there. Remember, we're all in this together because basically right now, with the Senate runoffs and the games that the Republicans are playing, we're all, we, we're all that we have for each other. So please stay safe. Until then.